Primo's Honey. Stream the language. I'm Will Primo, and we're still talking about slate call. So we've chosen the slate, we've talked about how to yell, and in this short video, I want to talk about how to hold a striker. You'd think I'd talk about that before we talked about making a yell. But I don't want to give you too much information because you're going to begin to get a little success as you try to yell. But how you hold the striker can give you a crisper, more responsive sound. I like to choke mine about an inch, and I want to be sure that I've got the striker against the knuckle of my middle finger and on the hard part of the index finger right behind the knuckle. And then I'm pressing with my thumb. What that does, it, it, it holds it rigid. In contrast, if I was to put it on the soft part of this finger and a soft part of the, of the index finger, it absorbs sound. So on the knuckle of the middle finger, right behind the knuckle of the index finger, pressing it with the thumb, that will give you control and a more responsive sound. How you hold the striker, important. So experiment for you in different ways. And just remember, lay it down on your index finger against the knuckle of your middle finger and press with your thumb. Strikers, they're half the sound of any pot or slate call.